Hey guys, how's it going? My name's Otso and welcome back to Pokemon White. Today, hopefully we'll be able to get through Route 10 without any problems like we did last time because I did go grinding a little bit. I didn't grind out too much. I just got up to level 45 on everyone. We were, I think we had like Norville, the highest level Pokemon we had was Norville at level 44. Snek and Scoobert were about like 43 and then Sea Monkey was like 42 and then the other two were 40s. I grinded them up to level 45 because we kind of needed them to. They were... No one was doing good. So, hopefully... Because the Elite Four is about 45 to 50s levels. So, I'm thinking, hopefully, this is enough levels to get through this route. And then... Why is this in this... What? Why is the Master Ball in the item box? Wouldn't it... Oh, wait. No, no, never mind. I was like... Wait, is this the Pokeball box? Yes, it is. Okay, never mind. I, I was so confused. I was like, why are there Pokeballs in here? But, no. Um, I want to put on a Repel to get through here. But, I do think we should be able to coast through this um, this route. I don't want it to be too easy. I could have ground up to level 50. I'm probably going to have to do one more grinding session, probably before the Elite Four. I didn't want to do that. Um, these are going to be Fungus's, right? Yep. Fucking knew it. I'm just cutting these out because they're just annoying as shit. Alright, so good thing I did cut them out because... uh. Actually, if this is if this isn't one, I'm gonna show. Um, l hold up, let's see—is this gonna show the same thing? It's a Moongus. Um, level forty. <laughs> Good thing I grinded. Holy fuck! I think that that battle versus Chirin. I think that was a like battle to see if you're ready for this area. Cause god damn, like I know that like it was kind of that, but like still, I might have to grind again if the Pokemon are level forty. Like, what are you going to be? I'm really scared. Because if you're, like, level 45, I'm really fucking scared. You're a Sock? Okay, you got a Sock. What is that going to be? Level 40. Easy. Hmm. I don't want to say easy, but we should be able to deal with you. Um. Oh. I don't know if... I think he learned this while I was grinding. He got Giga Drain. Mega Drain has been upgraded, which is good. Um. I was looking at, um... At Sandy. Not Sandy. Sheila. And I am very concerned... Like, I could have sworn, start, um, I, I could have sworn, like, uh, like, Krokorok was, like, a good Pokemon. I mean, Krokorok is a good Pokemon, but, like, I thought it was, like, a good physical attacker. It's, mine is very well-rounded. Like, I think mine has all 80s in stats, and then I think the best is speed, or something like that. I don't know, let me, let me get it up right here to look at, because I was very concerned when I saw this with Sheila. Um... Oh, 60s, yeah. Really bad defensively. Like what? Like really good attacker, but really bad defensively. Really good speedster, but like, what? That's not good. Like no wonder why Sheila gets killed all the time. Also, I looked up the moves. Um, I think it's level 54, 53, 54. Uh, Sheila learns Earthquake, which we really need badly. I wish there was a way to tell the difference. There might be of these Pokeballs, but I'm not entirely sure. This is a whole new route over here. Holy shit. Oh, wow. Good. Okay, I was really expecting another uh, Fungus or Moongus or something like that. Um, Anything over here? That is probably a hidden item there, but I don't care. Hiker, what do you got? Um, oh, wait. Is this taking... No, wait, no. This isn't taking me to Victory Road. This is an offshoot of Victory Road. I got really scared. I was like, you said Victory Road. I really thought we were going to Victory Road, but no, we're good. So, we got Brett. You got a Girder. Okay. Um... I still don't know what the... Why does it have, like, tumors all over it? I'm not sure, but level 30... Oh, no. Oh, my God. I'm so used to what I was recording last time with um level uh, 40s that I got so scared about 38. I was like, oh, shit. Also, hold up. I cannot believe I forgot to say this. Now, I'm going to preface this with saying people are probably going to think this fake. I'm so sorry for not recording this. I, um... I was grinding. And I had to go somewhere. I was running really late. And I was like, oh, one more battle wouldn't hurt. And I encountered something. Uh, little tease. Little tease for later on in the video. I encountered something. I did not get to record it because I really had to leave. Like, I was like 15 minutes late to where I had to be. I was running really late. But, um, so I will share it off at the end of the episode if I remember. Um, probably am going to remember. But just in case I forget, I'm, I'm sorry. But there is something that I do want to show you guys. It is... I cannot believe I got it. Now, sadly, it is on a ROM hack. So, it's not fake. I, I'll tell you what. I encountered it with the normal odds. There's no, like, added stuff. If there's a way to prove it, let me know in the comments below if there's a way to prove that this is, like, 100% legit. Like, legit on a ROM hack. Like, 
it's not like a... Um, are you going to talk to me? Um, are you going to give me something? Oh, Dust Stone, okay. But it's like, I can't like... Like, it, it, it's not going to be able to be transferred into, like, Pokemon Home or something like that. Because it's on a ROM hack. It, like, it's not legit, but it's legit for a ROM hack. And if there is a way to prove that a Pokemon is legit on a ROM hack, let me know in the comments. Because I know that people are not going to believe what I'm going to show you guys. And it sucks. Because I really wish I could have recorded it, but I couldn't. And I'm so mad that I didn't. Because that would have been a great start to the episode, but I couldn't. Um, is this the start of Victory Road here? Are we... I, I thought, like, Route 10 would be a little bit longer, but we might start Victory Road. Holy crap. Okay. Um, two Pokemon. Saw's Buck. Your grass. Crap. Uh, not good. Because I think your grass normal, which means we're not going to be able to do really anything to you. We can just do Leaf Blade on you. I, I also... Oh, uh, your Sap Sipper. Fuck. Who am I going to put on, in for you? Because we really don't have... I mean, mm, Scoobert with Fire Fang. I, I was like... I, was, I had to think about that for a second, but, like, no... Really don't. Scoober with Fire Fang. But it's really good that um we have Snack leading us off. Because I'm pretty sure Victory Road... Victory Road for every single game has been a cave. With rock types and ground types. So, hopefully, um that's the case here. Because if so, Snack's leading us off and should be able to easily get through here. What What is this? Uh, what, what are you doing there? I, I didn't see the move that you used. Attack fell? Crap. Not good. Because uh, we are a physical attacker. Um, Aromatherapy. Okay, that's what you use? No? Maybe? No, what is this? I don't know what that did. I'm so confused. I hate how they don't, like, tell you exactly what it did. Wow. That's not good. <laughs> that was not good at all. It's kind of be uh, tough here. Okay. You can just heal yourself. Well, we're just going to hopefully you get burnt. No, of course not. Um. Oh, I could use... No, I would say I could use Ice Fang. But I'd rather get the burn than the freeze, if I'm being honest. Because I think it can keep healing itself. I'd rather get burn than freeze. Let's go. Crit. Love it. Let's go, Scoobert. Um, next up, ooh, Snack's level 46. Massive. Jellicent. Okay, we're going back into um to Snack. I'm thinking probably for the Elite Four, because the um the uh because like I think it's N is like level 50. I don't know if you fight N right after the Elite Four, like you don't have any time to ch uh, heal. I have to check that before I go in. Cause if it's just the um if it's just battling the Elite Four and then nothing, like you can go heal. I'm probably going to aim for, like, level 47, 48 for all my guys. But if we're going against N, I'm probably going to aim for, like, 50 to 52. Something in that range, probably, when I go grinding. Which probably won't be for another episode, too, because I don't know how long Victory Road is in this game. I don't think I ever... I, I got here... I played this game once, and it was so long ago. And, like, Victory Road, probably... I don't think I spent a lot of time here. It was very much like, I just want to get going. Ugh. Not good. Not good. Ice, not good. Um, hmm. I think we go into Norville for this one. Just because, uh, ice. And, uh, yeah. Nah, I don't want to keep Snack in here against an ice type. That would not be very fun. Like, if we were to do that, that would be bad. Like, very bad. So, Icicle Crash, it shouldn't do too much to us, right? Um, yeah. So, we will use a Brick Break, which I don't know when Norville... if. When or if Norville can learn a better fighting type move? Do I need to get TMs? I'm going to have to look up. I think what I'll do is... I keep asking these questions. But I think once we get out of Victory Road, when we're at the Elite Four, like when we're at the building, I think I'll look... Uh, Se Seismitoad, that's um water. I think when we get to the Elite Four building, I will look up like everyone's moveset and see like when they learn certain moves. And if not, how to get certain moves that are better. Because a lot of our guys... I don't feel like are optimized truly. Like, Scoobert, perfect. Scoobert is perfectly rounded. Like, he is the... He's the one that I think has the perfect moveset. Snek, I think, is really good. Like, really, really good with his moveset. Because he can um, he can heal himself very well. Um, okay, Escavalier. Es Escavalier. I think that's uh, Excadrill's... Well, no, it's not. It's a bug. Crap. Bug steal. Um, we're getting out of here and going into North... Uh, let's go into Shield, I guess. We can use Dig. Um, but, like... We've got, um, Snack and Scoobert are good. Sea Monkey can't learn anything else, really. Like, I mean, we can maybe get a better... Maybe an ice... Mm, I was going to say an ice-type move, but, like, we already have set with, uh... Whoa! What? Whoa! Oh! Forgot Bug was good against Dark. Not great. <laughs> Not great for Sheila. Forgot she was also a glass cannon that we shouldn't be switching into. But, um... Like, I think Sea Monkey, other than Scratch, we're going to find a better move than Scratch, probably. I'm going to have to give a TM or something like that. Um, not good. 
shit, Sheila's dead, of course. Um, then we've got uh, uh, Sandy, which is really good. I think Sandy's perfect. Sandy's got the perfect move sets. Um, hmm. I guess we'll go. In, no, we'll go with Sea Monkey. I guess. Um, Sandy's perfect. Uh, Sheila needs Earthquake, which is at like level 54. So I mean, Sheila might be going into the Elite Four as our strongest Pokemon just so that we can get Earthquake. Um, not gonna lie, that would probably be my guess. And then, um, then Norville, I just like to get a better fighting type move. Like, we got some really good dark type moves, but we need a better fighting type move. Like, that's, n like, no joke. We need something. Okay, hopefully there's a healer in here. I'm gonna assume not. I'm probably gonna assume no, right? Maybe? No? You, oh, you're gonna, okay, you're doing the whole badge thing. Which is really interesting how they got rid of this after, like, Gen 1. Like, is this the first one to go back to it? Because they had it in Gen 1. Then Gen 2, it was just a guy at Victory Road to check all of your badges. Then Gen 3 didn't have this. I still have my repel on. Never mind. Um, Gen 4 didn't have this. And Gen 5 does. So, like, that's interesting. I, I kind of forgot about this, if I'm being honest. But it's a really cool thing. Because it does... It feels like you actually accomplished something. The only problem that I don't like is they're doing this in an area that you can't get to without getting all the badges. Like, I don't actually, maybe you can get here without having the last badge. But like, Gen 1, you couldn't get here without getting everything. What are you? Gates are placed at the border of one space and another space. In other words, gates mean that the world beyond here is a different world. It does feel like every time you pass through a gate, you're going to a different world. And remember, the gym leader who gave, say, uh, blah, who gave you the badge at the same time. But without the Quake badge, you cannot proceed. Okay. He said world a lot in that. Did he not? I'm saying a, not now a lot. Like, I'm, I'm, I'm done. Um, this is a lot. So, like, how far do we get? So, this is the... This was the fifth gym badge. This is the sixth one now, I think. I think we're going through six. Then that means seventh is going to be... Whoa! Oh, my God. That just... I nearly crapped my pants. <laughs> I know that this is Pokemon, you don't take fall damage, but oh my god, I nearly crapped myself doing that. Holy crap, I, I was not ready for that at all. I was about to cry. Oh, don't- is this a puzzle? No. Oh wait, no, it's, it's not that hard. Okay, it was not as hard as I thought it was. That really scared me. I thought we were screwed. I love the music here. It's kind of good with the like, little, like, I love the marching band. And then like the don't, don't, like that, that in the background. Pretty good. I like it. It's not as great as like the original Indigo Plateau or Victory Road theme, I'm pretty sure. Like I pre oh no. Oh, this is very disgusting. Really? Oh, I don't like this. You're telling me that I'm gonna have to do a puzzle of this and that stuff? I don't know. Um let's go repel and maybe just like explore a little bit. Cause I don't know um where my repels here. I'm gonna have to buy more repels as well. But like I don't know how I feel about if I'm gonna have to like do different doors and that stuff in here. I'm gonna have to know surf. I might. Well, Steam Monkey's Scratch might get rid of for Surf. Um, okay, we got a trainer here. I guess we'll battle you, see what the levels are here. I'm gonna assume you're probably gonna be really strong. Really scared of what I'm about to see here because uh, this could be very bad or... Okay, there's no good in this scenario. It's bad or meh. Um, okay, you're grass. Oh! 45! What? What? That, uh, ha, 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 ha. That's, uh, that's fun. <laughs> Ain't it now? I, uh, hmm. Did not expect them to be this high level. Holy, I might have to go back and just buy hyper potions and just hyper potion my, and revive my way through this, this thing. Cause I don't want to have to train until we get to the end of Victory Road. Like I want to grind when we're right next to the Pokemon Center or something like that. But this is not, not good. Not great at all. Um, okay, we can kill it with one more. It shouldn't be able to kill us unless Mega Drain. Crap. I knew something was gonna happen there. Um, okay. Let's see. So, uh, we're probably- Unless we get a, a, um, crit or a lucky roll, we're not gonna be able to get this. We got a lucky roll. Let's go. Massive. Scoobert coming in clutch. As always. What else is new? Um, Snek leveled up again. Holy crap. Let's go. Um, then Zebstrika. Sheila's dead. <laughs> of course. The one Pokemon that we have for this, and and Sheila's dead. <laughs> okay, um, we'll go into Snack because he, he resists it. But the one Pokemon I have that for, oh my god, <laughs> that's not good. <laughs> why, why, oh why, oh why, why can't why why can't um Sheila have good defense? 
Like, I'm not asking for good special defense. Just have good defense defense. You're a ground type. You're supposed to. Like, oh my god. Okay, that's gonna... This is gonna be annoying. I can tell right now. This, um, victory road is not gonna be fun. I can... I, I know this right away. I do think probably, um... I was saying about maybe getting a coverage move for Sea Monkey. I'm thinking that Scratch is probably gonna have to be used up for Surf. Maybe Water Gun gets, um... Gets... Uh, we get rid of it for a coverage move. I don't know what coverage move it can learn, though. That's the problem. Like, I don't know. And it's also a physical attacker, which sucks, because all the moves that it can learn are special. I don't know. But, um, I do want to head back to, um, the, uh, um, town. Uh, what was it? Is it? No. O, 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 P, o, P, S, whatever it is. I, I can't remember. I can't remember. It's the one after Icarus. I want to head back there so we can heal up. And also, I want to show you guys what I got. Because I am very proud of it. But, uh, I, 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 yeah. I got, oh, is it a puzzle to get back? Wait. Can I not get back? Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Okay. I can go there. Okay. I don't like ice, if you can't tell. I don't know. But I'm going to go, um, back to the Pokemon Center. And I will see you guys then. Okay. I am at the Pokemon Center. I need to heal up first. But... I am very proud of what I found, because I did not expect to ever get this in a ROM hack. Like, never. I, I actually hate that I got it in a ROM hack. It, it, it's bugging me. Because I can't transfer it to Pokemon Home, which really kills me. It's not a legitimate Pokemon because it's a ROM hack. It's legitimate for a ROM hack, but not legitimate to the actual main series of Pokemon games. But I caught something. I caught something while I was grinding. And oh boy, I love it. Um, if you can see, hey, there's a herd deer there. Wh wh why? Why is there a herd deer there? It's cause it's a shiny herdier. I caught it at um at the at route ten, right above like right where you uh. Not, I want to do the summary, um right above the like uh the tunnel area, but I met on route ten at level thirty three. I <laughs> I'm so mad. I'm so I'm so mad that I caught this off camera. I really wish I could have recorded, but I couldn't. But there we go, level thirty three, shiny. Goobert Jr. Oh my god. I love it. I love it. it it's the greatest thing ever. I just... Mm, I, it, when I saw it, I was so happy. I had... It was 50-50 motion of happy and... Are you kidding me? Why can't I find that on a normal game when I'm playing it? Like, on the Switch or something like that. It pissed me off, but... I got a shiny herd here. And with that... That's gonna do it for this episode. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you guys liked the video, leave a like and subscribe. It helps me out a bunch. And if you do subscribe... Hit the notification bell, notifies you every time I upload. Yeah, I will see you guys in the next episode when we take on Victory Road. Bye!